one, mate. Hello, everybody. I'm Charlie. Welcome to Street Dancing. It's go time. Nobody blink, okay? Nobody blink. Don't do it. And you join us today as we observe the lesser spotted ray in his natural environment <laughs> of the jungle. <laughs> And here we have Bant and Jack. They're not quite Ant and Deck. They're like one letter off. Look. It's not a bad likeness, but... Ugh. They do have that slightly like, Arabic creepy looking, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, they definitely got that. I mean, look at them eyes. And there's some sexy bitch in the middle. Look at them eyes, there. Yeah. yeah, you look way better than these two, definitely. <laughs> Yeah, 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 mate, them eyes are scary. <laughs> them eyes are scary. scary. Yes, uh, we've gone into the uncanny valley. <laughs> All the way into the uncanny valley. <laughs> well, that's one bit just driving over here. Um, <laughs> I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. No, I'm not. I'm a YouTuber, but I agree with Ray. Get me out of here. <laughs> So, Alan, I've heard that you are a chatty man. That's interesting, I'm also a chatty man. Uh, people also say I'm maybe the loudest person in the world. I might be louder than you. I don't know if you say that, though. But uh, it's a bit quiet in it today, that's weird. Yeah. Why is he so quiet? I don't know, he's supposed to be a chatty guy. I mean, I'm having to do all work here, aren't I? I'm doing all work, I'm boring. Oh, well. <laughs> A little bit, look. It's a little bit. Oh, darn it. Looks like it's going to fall off. It does. <laughs> the super specky on the car has had a bit too much to drink. Came along before when yeah. she dodged it, and I was kind of like, yeah, he's, um, he's not a steady man, is he? No, he's I'm, a chatty man, but not Alan a steady car man. Unsteady man. <laughs> the yeah. super specky Alan he's Carr. A lovely. Man. lovely. Man. See you now. This bit's about football, so I can't really tell you how. Uh, my knowledge of football is infinitesimal. You're not a football fan, are you? No. Oh, you're not a football fan? I wouldn't fan. know one of them if they passed me on the street. No, oh, I'm, I'm pretty sure... That's that that bloke's Wayne Rooney. That's Wayne Rooney. I couldn't tell you who he is. I couldn't tell you who he is. That's, um... I'd, I'd talk about Wayne Rooney, but unfortunately anything that we can say about Wayne Rooney doesn't really... Um, this thing in this vlog because it wouldn't be family friendly. Goat. <laughs> and um, <laughs> that's Alan all down here. Okay, you've got a bit less air. Doesn't matter, he didn't win that one. Hey, you'll be off to McDonald's for a fillet of fish lake. I'm, I'm slightly more of a with you this morning. Well, this is Lewis Hamilton. He's a racing driver. I know that one. Well, Gary's having the boat with that. Yes! Right, okay. Are you ready for that? It's kind of darts, but it's, it's actually sort of yeah. safety darts that are just bean bags for some strange reason. Ah. Rubbish. 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 <laughs> I was doing it left handed, to be I swear honest. Say we're good then. I am left handed. Oh, well. Fine, Jack. 20s. Triple 20s. Oh. No. Hey! Okay, okay. So we're going, we're going left handed and we hit, we're holding them all in one hand. Um, 
Hey, but I got it, I got it in the basket. That's actually quite funny. Bear in mind, I'm doing this with the wrong hand and I'm also flicking them out of my fingers because I'm trying to hold all of them in one hand at the same time. So... Hey, you got that, that one. I got it. I nearly got it in the thing as well. Hey, look, I got it and I got it in there. Nice. Come on, that's that's good. I think that was good. Hey, look, it's Mermaid Ali. I've been told that it stings like and floats like a butterfly and stings like a bee when I say it right. You know. Good boxer. Actually, real sad. Real sad, because um, he got like uh, Alzheimer's or something, did he? Degenerative disease. And, um, there's something real sad about Mami Dali not being able to throw a punch anymore, you know? It's, uh, well, to it. Can I can remember what it is. Like, there's, there's, a, there's a WrestleMania, and Mami Dali like, goes on as a guest, and he like, he like, he like punches his guy. But the problem is by that time he's like he's so unwell that he just can barely throw a punch and it there's something real sad about that, you know, but probably better to remember him when he was more like this. So here we have the hammer of four. Who's, who, whosoever holds his hammer shall be deemed worthy to possess the powers of four. That's what I'm saying, right? So, we, we're going to try and pick the hammer up, right? I can't pick it up, it moves. I can move it. So, I've, I've got to be at least as good as Vision, right? He can move it. Captain America, if I was Captain America, I could pick it up, clearly, but... Nah, not... Nah, I can move it, I can't pick it up. Then here we have Paul Odinson. So, Chris, how are you doing today? It's a bit quiet, isn't it? You've been to gym. Spends a lot of time in gym, this bloke. Eat a lot of chicken, don't you? Yeah. Although I think I think real Chris Hemsworth is probably bigger than this guy, if I'm honest. I mean, he's taller than me, but that's not hard to do. But like, I mean, he doesn't seem thicker than me, does he? And he, he probably should be. Oh, nearly, he nearly got it. Yeah, he's tall enough, but like, so I think Chris Hemsworth could be a bit wider though. Goes to gym a lot. So here we are, it's the Incredible Hulk. Hulk smash! is what Hulk says generally. But who says that? Do you know who it is who does the voice of the Hulk still in the movies, right? So it ain't Mark, Mark ain't doing it, right? The guy who does the voice for the Incredible Hulk still to this day in the films is Lou Ferrigno, who is the guy who played the Hulk in the 1970s live action television show. And there's an episode in that where he fights a bear, right? And that's, this is in the 70s. That's no CGI bear. That's a real bear. He paints himself green and goes up to the bear and goes, Bruh! like Lou Ferrigno, brave guy. Mark Ruffalo ain't doing that. Now I've got Iron Man here. It's Tony Stark. Although I don't know. They've turned, in the films, they've turned Iron Man to like, sort of like a cool guy, right? Because they got Robert Downey Jr. Uh, in there. And like, that's kind of good work because prior to that, Iron Man had a bad image in the comic books for a long time. Not sure they've quite managed to fix Ant-Man yet though. See, this is Ariana Grande, right? She ain't very grande, is she? She's in fact very short. Way shorter than me. So wait, when you get coffee, right, and you get like the big ones and they're grande, right? And the little ones are they pico? 
the Pico's small, right? So she, she should be Ariana Pico because she's tiny. It's got Lady Gaga, Ariana. I mean, we can quite easily walk up and, uh, and poke a face, look, that's easy. You're right in there, look. Uh, yeah, but what, what is with this outfit, look? Like, this is... Uh, I mean, it's waxwork, so hopefully this, this isn't violating any, any YouTube terms and conditions or anything. But, like, like, if this was a person, I'm pretty sure that that outfit would be. See, technically they got this wrong, haven't they? This is the Abbey Road cover. Why have they put him sandals on? He's supposed to have bare feet. That's right, we do. We look for many. He's not getting anything in them pockets, is he? <laughs> so, how's it going? You want to sing a song? We could do one of yours. He's not getting in on it, is he? Grab me a guitar, I'll get in hand if you want. I'll play a bit of Day Tripper. No, he's not going for it. Here we have a mirror maze. We got Liz. Liz is here. It's the only way you're going to see her nowadays, unfortunately. Um, I don't know, I'm not like a big role person or anything, but it is a bit sad when you lose the Queen, you know. Good lady, the Queen. I mean, I don't know many other people who are there giving a speech two days before they die. Like, commitment there, like, uh, probably can't get a higher order than, than this lady, you know. Our comedians once said, with a long enough lever and a stable enough platform, I could move the world. Uh, I think he probably could have stood on uh, Liz's shoulders for that one and he would have been all right. Scott KSI here. Yeah? What's this bloke saying? Oh, uh, he's saying... Does he, he says wicked a lot, right? I've never watched him. I don't know. I don't even know who he is. I've, I've vaguely... I, 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 know, I know that he makes a lot of money by having a fight with Logan Paul. Oh, right. That's what I know. That's what I know about this guy. And it looks like somebody who would use the words wicked and bruv a lot. And he probably says fam too, like Charlie Sloth, doesn't he? I'm Charlie, but I'm not Charlie Sloth. I don't call everybody fam. He might do though, I suspect. So this is Boris. It's not actually Boris, it's a model of Boris. Boris isn't doing too bad, he's not that unsteady. Alan Carr downstairs were a, a bit more wobbly than that. Reportedly, these are in fact Boris's real clothes. So, where does Boris shop? Boris shops at the Savoy Tailors Guild, established 1906. So, probably quite expensive clothes. Quality, I don't know, I think he would have been just about as well getting some out of Burton's, wouldn't he? Uh, what's his tie, what's his tie got? <laughs> Salvatore Fer Fer Ferrangio? I don't know, that's, that's kind of tricky to read, but okay, there you go, Boris. Jog on. It's Joanna Lumley. Is this Avengers Joanna Lumley? I think this is Avengers Joanna Lumley, isn't it? Maybe. I, I'd say she's the Ab Fab. This is the Ab Fab one. I don't know, but, I'm, but look, no, because you've got the mini here, that's what I'm thinking. 
Yeah, maybe. But so is she? She's. But she's. She's. I suppose she's got the hair up. She's not got the bob. If she had the bob, then it'd be the purdy bob. Yeah. And then, then it'd be like the Avengers one. But I suppose. Okay, then. So we have to do. Uh, we have to do Ab Fab, Joanna Lumley, which is funny. But Joanna Lumley in real life is like a really nice lady. Like. Super nice, but she's not in Ab Fabs. But then we, that means we do get to say, Sweetie Darlings, though. Sweetie Darlings. Hey, Sweetie Darlings, how are we doing, Sweetie Darlings? Darlings, Darlings, Sweetie, Sweetie Darlings. You just got to say it a lot, that's how it works. Right, so I'm here, we're outside Madame de Swords. I'm going to talk like this because we've got Ed Sheeran playing in the background and he's going to copyright claim me otherwise, isn't it? They like this song, it'll be about six times going around here. Right. Yeah, pretty decent in there. I mean, uh, some of them waxworks definitely, definitely tip the board towards the Uncanny Valley and look a bit creepy. Ant and Deck in there looking a bit creepy, but overall not too bad. We've had a bit of a laugh, wander around, talk about a few things, you know. Hopefully I've been vaguely interesting for you here at Madden to Sort. But uh, yeah, from here, it's go time. Thank you for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, drop me a like and a comment. And if you want to see more of my stuff, then you could check out my channel and subscribe and hit the bell.